What's up guys, this is Merc Music and welcome to Call of Duty Online 2. Just to get everyone caught up, I recently did a video called This Will Save Call of Duty, and I was covering a new mod called SM Squared. And a lot of people have been drawing comparisons between SM Squared and Call of Duty Online because it's going to have a progression system, it's going to have all kinds of different content from multiple Call of Duty games, it's going to have old school maps, OG weapons like that, it's going to run on the Modern Warfare 2 engine, and it's also going to have content from Call of Duty Online. So yeah, in essence, the SM Squared mod has already kind of been dubbed like COD Online Remastered or COD Online 2. But here's the catch, when I was watching the gameplay reveal, I didn't stick around to the end where they actually teased an actual Call of Duty Online weapon. And it led to them tweeting this. Missed something at the end of our gameplay reveal? We know Merc Music did. Go star for Eric! The Freedom, one of many unique Caught Online weapons coming to SM Squared. So let's check this out. This is from Twitter, so I'm sorry if the quality is really bad. Oh, it's kind of getting better. This is an inspect of one of the guns from Call of Duty Online. I believe it's a hybrid, like, shotgun assault rifle, maybe? I guess we'll find out. Gotta keep watching. Oh, it's switching, probably. Oh no, it's shotgun sniper hybrid! Kind of like Infinite Warfare, which is actually really cool. I can't wait to use this. It looks so good. I don't even know how they managed to get the assets from COD Online. I mean, that it, on its own is very impressive. So yeah, this just has me even more hyped for the SM Squared project. I can't wait until it's actually like playable. If I'm not mistaken, SM Squared is still in the early stages of development, so it's still going to be some time before, you know, anyone can actually play. I don't know if they're going to have any early testing for the game, but I would love to hop in and play it and check it out. Because honestly, even without these really unique Call of Duty Online variants and stuff that got added into the game, it really does seem like this project project is exactly what COD Online originally set out to do. Literally just take the best content from the best Call of Duty games in the past and combine them all into one game that still has progression and has some new features. So yeah, if you guys are excited for SM Squared or basically Call of Duty Online 2, make sure to drop a like. And if you didn't happen to notice, Code Merc is currently 30% off of G Fuel from now up until the 28th. I'm currently drinking Wumpa Fruit. It's been sitting for a bit though, but I mean, I love it. <laughs> but yeah, if you want to save yourself some money on G Fuel, I have a link in the description or you can go to my Twitter. I have the link on there too. I wish I had more to show off for the SM Squared mod, but that was pretty much much it we're gonna be on cold war today we're gonna be clowning around today oh god it's right there it's a tracer pack we got the big joke three pack i can't believe how many clown skins they're just shoving into these call of duty games man like it's it's just kind of weird at this point get down to the funny business <laughs> with tracer pack big joke three no the blueprints feature paint splatter tracer okay wait so it actually has like a paintball gun mp5 how long has this been out I feel like I'm really slow when it comes to this stuff. Does this actually shoot paintballs? Oh, it does. Paintball tracer rounds. Spooky off. Uh, it doesn't really come with too much other cool shit. I mean, I guess the tracer rounds, like, variants are kind of cool. But then you have the greed skin for Sims. I thought this was going to be for Garcia. So I'm kind of emo about that. But God, look how ugly that shit is. <laughs> Why so serious? What does it actually say? It says, I'm with crazy on the button. Okay. Any other details we got going on? Is that... Are those cheese cubes? He's a little hammer boy. What's in the backpack? Okay, he's got a bunch of money. I feel like this one could be a little bit more creative with the other details, but the mask alone has got me sold. It's by the least amount possible. I guess I'm $5 short of COD points. There we go. Woohoo! What else we got in the store? Oh god, what is that? So hideous, dude. <laughs> what are these skins? The suplex takedown? Yep, this game is now a wrestling game. Squirt Frog. Who names these, man? Who's coming up with these? I don't know. I just make the shoes. <laughs> this is so ugly. Just add a bunch of bots. Look at all the clowns, dude. <laughs> It doesn't have a custom inspection or anything. It's still the same. I mean, that looks pretty cool, though. Wait. Oh, they don't have the clown skin. I thought they'd have the skin. Well, I'm stupid. Okay. You think you can take me? I wanted to flick off the clowns, but <laughs> I don't have it. Like, they're all just basic default skins. I wish you could change the skins of the bots. That would be a pretty neat feature. Let's get it, Vondi. Yes. You know you want to. Okay, so here's the paintball effects. Let's see. Wait. Oh, it's headshots only. I'm an idiot. Let's try it again. Come here. Oh, okay. So yeah, if you use these variances, it'll basically turn the game into paintball mode from Advanced Warfare. As a slouch in Brighton, I think it'd be pretty neat if the Nipao Power Glunguses had paintball mode. I can't upload this game to my Fortnite channel because it's not family friendly enough. Boop, 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 no! Flag! Feed! Hey, well, let's get that one on. I'll use the paintball gun in a sec, but I want to hit with the MG82. Oh, that's a teammate. Well, I'm great. I really don't like this map that much for feeds. I don't know what it is. I just run circles up here. Oh. <laughs> The street sweeper, man. Oh my god. The one thing I am absolutely... Oh. There's one thing I don't particularly... Wait, I got it? <laughs> Who's the fourth guy I killed? What the fuck? Okay, I can put this thing away forever. Woohoo. But yeah, man. Like, the only thing that kind of sucks about the hardcore face-off is that the street sweeper is so prevalent. And people still do the gung-ho exploits. So, like, I don't even know. I'm lagging. Oh, my lag. What? What? Damn, we're like getting like drops to 60. Do I do any new drivers? I don't know why, but I just had this fucking hilarious realization that like the people who are working on SM Squared are working so hard to actually bring us a really cool mod that's going to resemble Call of Duty Online. And <laughs> what do we get on Cold War? This. Yeah, more clown skins. Hey, it's my feed. I still don't. 
Oh, that was a double kill right there. That guy was trying to street sweeper me from way up there. What the? I've got to find a different lobby. All right, so we got the MP5. We got the Magnums. Let's go. We're playing paintball now. I still wish Call of Duty Paintball Warfare was a thing. That was one of the coolest Call of Duty 4 mods, and I would love to see it come back. Everyone on their team is just... Just shut up and focus. I've got a new thing. I gotta tell myself this every time I play this game. There's probably nothing I can do to change the minds of the losers who camp in this game. It is what it is. The only thing I can do is just do my best to try to counter them and kill them. Because they're not gonna stop camping or pre-firing spawns out of their own free will. Woo! I thought they were still gonna spawn their shit. I'll take the quad though, why not? I'm surprised I was able to move around that much. Out of all the face-off maps, I think I hate this one the most. <laughs> Everyone just wants to camp and watch the lanes. Like, can you get any more boring? Fuck. I mean, look. There's multiple people. You got the bus, you got the middle, you got the back. It's just always the same shit with this game. You know, if the players wanna just play hardcore like timid little gerbils, that, that's their decision. I always manage to find a way to feed them, so fuck it. They have the reaction of dead animals. I mean, look at them. When they actually have to kill someone, they can barely do it. I almost had a kill chain there. They must have known we were coming. Uh, yeah, they, they, they knew we were coming. This is what happens when they don't have their sights up already or they're crouching around and they already have you. They just get fucking destroyed. Look at that. I mean, I only had 30 rounds on the MP5. Imagine if I had more. They would have all been dead. I'm gonna make this MP5 the best fucking paintball gun you ever see. Does this thing actually shoot paintballs ever? It does. Okay, I actually... That's really cool. Wait, does that mean you can spell stuff out? Oh, shit. Dude, I'm trying to do something. Get out of my way. Okay, well, this is, like, almost impossible to write. The fact that this community of players still just wants to camp in, in 6v6 face-off, like, what the f- Why? Nope. He's still- Why? Why is it always the Captain Price skins in this game that are camping? I wish they had mounting in Cold War. Ugh. You know what the real Captain Price would have to say to you? You're a loser, mate. He might say to check your corners, but it doesn't mean become the corner. I'm talking about <laughs> shit, dude. I, I fucked that up. I'll admit that one was on me. There we go. Why are you, dude? You were oh, he's gonna break his damn neck trying to camp there. I feel so bad for Captain Price having all these people play him and just ruin his look. You sound fucking eleven, kid. Shut up. Well, better than you, so. Fuck no, bitch. We can one v one. The camper was arguing with a twelve-year-old. Oh boy. Neither of you are good. No, no, you're not. They're they're both at the bottom of the fucking leaderboard. I'm not trying to be mean. It's just it's the truth. <laughs> I'll prove it too. I mean, there was the twelve-year-old. There was the guy camping. I wonder if SM Squared's gonna have clown skins. I hope it doesn't. I can't remember if the makers of the mod said if they're gonna have skins or not. I mean, I think they might have weapon variants, but I think they're just gonna be cosmetic only. What? Laying in the bed. What a surprise. I swear to God, this game is gonna birth so many, like, camping cues and sound effects. I'm eventually just gonna be- Wow, you're existing. What a surprise. <laughs> I just can't anymore. <laughs> how did he slide into that? You guys saw that shit, Coming. right? Oh! Oh, they're calling me out. That's how they know. Oh, he's coming over here. <laughs> Fuck, he jacked it. I wanna keep going. Kill chain. Paintball kill chain. Anyone else? Fuck, did I get it? I got it! Go whore! 52 to 24. Absolute beast. Holy shit. Dude. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Oh, he didn't come out. I got the ultra kill, it was so close to the kill chain. If that one dude just came out. <laughs> Fuck! That was sick, dude. So many feeds in this video. This is exactly why I've been having so much fun playing hardcore face-off. The maps are just so much smaller, everything happens so quickly. It's great for feeds and hitting clips. I mean, I love it. It's just so much faster paced than typical Cold War. I almost had it dragged over, man. Come on. Trying to get this kill chain. Oh my god, <laughs> he's doing the gungo glitch with the MG. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> ah. I was about to have so many. Hey, it's not gonna play though. I think this is the ultra kill. Oh my, <laughs> that kill was so ridiculous. 
this was a miracle. I mean, they were like killing me all the other times I tried to pull that off. But that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the COD Online gun reveal for SM Squared along with some dank feats on Cold War. If you guys did enjoy this video and you're excited for COD Online 2 or just more clown skins, make sure to drop a like. I'll see you guys later. I don't need it. 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 I don